Hey folks, Father Sampati from CG Virus here. Today we're going to see how to work with multiple shots in Natron. So, uh, this is a very common format, uh, common production scenario where you have a sequence, you have some multiple shots, and you need to do it in one project. So, how to do it in Natron? Let's see. We're going to use Dope Sheet and uh, we're going to use Read Note for this one. So, I have already loaded. Uh, let's name it to S1. I have already loaded three scene. So this one is scene 2. I'm going to do it here. S2. Sorry. S2. And uh, let's load this guy. S3. Okay. So these are three shots. I'm going to save it. Uh, let's use multi shot. Save. Yes. Okay. Let's save it. Alright. Uh, so first thing first is basically let's go to the S1. You can see here it says the first frame is 1 and last frame is 229, right? So if I go here, let's go to beyond 229, you can see it has been freezed, okay? If you go to 2019, it's working, but after 229, it will freeze, freeze here forever. So why it's freezing is basically for this before and after before hold and after hold to make multiple shots you need to do before error and after error error means after the last frame it will not load any frame from this read file so we have to do it for everyone so before error after error and this one before error after error okay done control is save so now let's talk about the properties beam. Uh, let's talk about the dope sheet. So let's go here. I am uh, activating it in our property bin. Go to the dope sheet, and you can see there is S1. So I need to load three, uh, three read files. So uh, let's use ten here for simplicity. So ten. If I use ten, it will load ten properties bin. Ten properties in properties bin. So I'm just going to S1 and press S2, press S3. Now let's go to the dope sheet. You can see S1, S2, S3. All right. If I close one, it will go vanished. So what you need to do is basically load all of your read file first. Okay. First thing first, done. Now let's go to the S1. There we go. This is the S1. So what we need to do is basically just drag it here. Let's go close there we go this one is s2 and let's go close yeah yeah there we go so they are in line now we need to see them right so how can we see them press ctrl s save so let's do the node graph patch a march press m so the first shot should be b the second shot should be a uh, sometimes you need to change it sometimes you need to swap it so yeah so this is b this is a so now if we go after here you can see our shot two is there if you want to see the shot three let's go there Yeah, the shot two is finished. The shot three here. So what you need to do is basically <coughs> go to the march note. This one is B. This one is A. There we go. This one. Here we go. Okay. So here is your three shots. This one is. Let it load. Yeah, okay. So we need to set the project here. So let's go to shot 3. This one is 459. Sorry. Starting from, starting from 459. Okay, let's go to the dope sheet and let's see. This one is 949. So what the dope sheet is doing is basically offsetting your starting frame. So this one is S, uh, you know, the S3 is coming from 459. The, let me see let's go here s1 this is coming from starting from one 
this one s2 is coming from starting from 233 so in the dope sheet you will see that okay so that's how you can work with it so i'm just going to dope sheet uh, let's see oops oops yeah so let's see this one is 949 so our project should be 949 frame 949 okay so this is our project okay so let's see some applications here so let's use some uh, what can we do um, okay let's go to the S1 first short one there we go so let's use some color correction press C color correct let's use saturation just random stuff comma stuff like that let's go to the S2 you can see your settings here S2 here this one is S2 so there we go let's select okay uh let's use another color question here something like that let's use saturation let's use contrast gamma something like that okay fine now let's go to the dope sheet again yeah let's go to the dope sheet and let's use here there we go this should be our the last one there we go let's control let's save okay whoops sorry for that yeah i'm recording and doing stuff so loads of pressure there we go so let's go to s3 yep uh we need some reformat so let's just reformat here there we go so let's use uhd i'm using 4k by the way uh uhd yep so let's use quite obviously we need some gear so let's use gear from a gear there we go and there we go that's it so that's how you can work with it all right and the merge over it should be the last one yeah so this is the tips to work with it pretty easy there we go all right let's save it so that's it so I'm Father Simpathic from CG Virus and we're going to see you next time. Bye bye.